What's up guys, Strax here. Today I'm going to be bringing you guys another short video. Today I'm going to be showing you guys how you guys can get the paramedic belt on any outfit without doing the transfer glitch. So you guys won't be losing any of your outfits with this glitch. But yeah, so now I'm just going to go ahead and show you guys how to get it. So you, first you guys are going to want to head to a clothing store. After you guys get to a clothing store, make sure you guys are wearing the outfit that you guys want the paramedic belt on and make sure you guys are able to put a utility vest on with the outfit that you guys are wearing. So whenever you guys get to a clothing store, go over here to your tops, go ahead and scroll down to utility vest, which is on slot 52, and you guys are going to be looking for the peach plate carrier. So the peach plate carrier is right here on slot 43, so you guys are going to want to go ahead and equip the peach plate carrier. So after you guys go ahead and equip it on your outfit, then you guys are just going to want to go ahead and save your outfit on slot 1 or slot 20. But before you guys do save it, make sure your character doesn't have any head accessories like his helmet, mask, earpiece, or rebreather. Just make sure you guys have every head, every head accessory off your character. So after you guys do that, with, and you guys are wearing the Peach Plate Carrier, now you guys are going to want to go ahead and save this outfit on slot 1 or slot 20. It doesn't matter. But after you guys do that, now you guys are just going to want to go ahead, back out, scroll down to Heist Coveralls, which is on slot 13. And you guys are going to want to go ahead and scroll down from slot 9 through slot 12. So you guys can wear any of these toxic mask outfits or any of these science test outfits. It doesn't matter. As long as it does have the toxic mask like, like this one. After you guys do that, now you guys are going to want to go ahead and go to the pier where there is a telescope. So I'll get back to you whenever I do get to the telescope on the pier. Okay guys, so once you guys get to the pier and you guys are in front of a telescope, just go ahead and do the telescope glitch. So just run, hit right on the D-pad, your character's mask and hoodie will come off. So go ahead and pull up your interaction menu, scroll down to style, and go ahead and equip the outfit you guys saved on slot 1 or slot 20. After you guys do that, then you guys are going to want to go ahead and walk away. And as you guys can see, the toxic mask does come on your outfit. So now you guys are just going to want to head to the clothing store or mask store and go ahead and save this outfit on slot 1 or slot 20, whichever you saved it on before. So after you guys go ahead and saved your outfit, now you guys are just going to want to go ahead and start up a titan of a job. So just hit pause, scroll to online, hit jobs, play jobs, rockstar created, scroll down to missions, and then you guys are just going to want to go ahead and start up a titan of a job. So whenever you guys are right here, you guys can just go ahead and confirm your settings and then just go ahead and hit play. It's going to ask if you guys want to launch the job on your own. Just hit yes. So whenever you guys go ahead and load in, you guys will see that the peach plate carrier did come off your character and you guys should only be wearing the toxic mask. So the toxic mask and the outfit you guys created that you guys want the paramedic belt on. So after you guys have that, now you guys can go ahead and head to any gun store on the map. Whenever you guys get to a gun store, then you guys are just going to want to go ahead and walk over here to your clothing. And whenever you guys get to the outfits, you guys are just going to want to go ahead and save this outfit on slot 1 or slot 20, whichever you saved it on before. And after you guys go ahead and save that outfit, now you guys can just go ahead and pull up your phone and leave the job from your phone. Okay guys, so whenever you guys load back in, then you guys are just going to want to go ahead and equip an outfit that you guys have with the paramedic belt. Or if you guys don't have an outfit with the paramedic belt, then you guys are just going to want to go ahead and do the glitch at your facility. So if you guys don't know what I'm talking about, I'll get back to you whenever I do get to my facility. Okay guys, so whenever you guys are at your facility, I'm going to be showing you guys how you guys can get the paramedic outfit that gives you the paramedic belt also. So you guys are going to, whenever you guys are here at your facility, you guys are just going to want to go ahead and access your planning screen and go ahead and start act one. So whenever you guys go ahead and start up act one, then you guys are just going to want to go ahead and start up this setup that's called dead carrier. I believe that's what's called. And then you guys are just going to want to go ahead and launch it. And you guys are going to need a friend for this. So I'll get back to you whenever I do have a friend in here. So whenever you guys are in the dead carrier mission, then you guys are just going to want to make sure you have a friend in here. And once you guys have a friend in here, make sure you guys have the difficulty set to hard. And then you guys can just go ahead and confirm the settings. And then you guys can just hit play. So whenever you guys load in, you guys will have to be the host for this unless you guys can join the other team. But I'm pretty sure you guys do have to be the host for this. Go ahead and scroll down to outfits. And you guys are going to want to go ahead and make sure you have the green paramedic with the paramedic belt. So after you guys have that, you guys can do the blue, it doesn't matter, or you guys can use the green, it doesn't matter, because you guys are getting the paramedic belt either way. But after you guys are in the green paramedic, then you guys can just go and hit ready to play. 
So whenever you guys go ahead and spawn outside your facility, then you guys are just going to want to go ahead and blow up the ambulance. So whenever you guys go ahead and blow up the ambulance, the job will fail. And right whenever the stats show up, your friend will need to restart or the person that's not getting the paramedic belt. Make sure your friend restarts or the person that's not getting the paramedic belt needs to restart. And so whenever your friend restarts or whoever's not getting the paramedic belt, go ahead and reset your controller right whenever you see the downloading in the bottom right hand corner. And so your friend will message you or you guys can count to 30 to 40 seconds and then you guys will load in. So whenever your friend messages you and says that you guys are outside, you guys can go ahead and reconnect your controller and then you guys will see that you guys don't have a map anymore. So after you guys do that, now you guys are just going to want to go ahead and head to a gun store. So you guys aren't able to hit pause, so then you guys are able to see where the gun store is at. But then, so you guys are just going to have to remember it by memory. So just go ahead and head to the gun store. Whenever you guys go ahead and get to the gun store, then you guys are just going to want to go ahead and walk to the middle counter. So whenever you guys go ahead and get to the middle counter, then you guys are just going to want to go ahead and buy the LCD earpiece. After you guys do that, then all you guys need to do is just wait and have your friend invite you. So have him restart his game, and then whenever he loads back into a session, then have him invite you. But yeah, so just wait until he invites you and then just join his game and whenever you guys load in then you guys should have this paramedic outfit with the paramedic belt but if whenever if it does not let you inside the gun store whenever you guys first try then you guys can just go ahead and try go around the map and just try different gun stores but if that doesn't work if that doesn't work then go ahead and restart your game fully and then just try to do the glitch again and then it should work the second time that's what i had to do so whenever your friend goes ahead and invites you whenever he loads back in, you guys can just go ahead and join him. Whenever you guys go ahead and load back in with the paramedic outfit, you guys can see that I'm in a public session with people now, and so you guys should have got the paramedic outfit. So now, after you guys got the paramedic outfit, and you guys have the outfit you guys saved on slot 1 or slot 20, so after you guys have all that, then you guys are just going to want to go ahead and start up a crooked cop. So just go ahead and hit pause, scroll to online, hit jobs, play jobs, Rockstar created, scroll down to scroll down to versus, and then go ahead and scroll down to a crooked cop and start up a crooked cop. Okay guys, so whenever you guys go ahead and load into a crooked cop, make sure you have your clothing set to player owned. Then you guys can go ahead and launch the job. So whenever you guys go ahead and load into a crooked cop, go ahead and scroll down to your owned outfits. You guys should be wearing the paramedic outfit. And if you guys save the outfit that you guys want the paramedic outfit on slot one, scroll one time to the right. But if you guys saved your outfit on slot 20, scroll one time to the left. So after you guys do that, you guys should see that your outfit or the paramedic belt did transfer over to the outfit. Now you guys can just go ahead and hit ready to play. Whenever you guys go ahead and load into the Crooked Cop, you guys can now just go ahead and pull up your interaction menu, scroll down to Style, scroll down to Accessories, and on your gear, scroll one time to the left to put on the LCD earpiece. Go ahead and put away your interaction menu, and then you guys can just go ahead and pull up your phone and leave the job from your phone. Okay guys, so whenever you guys load back in, that's basically it. So you guys can just go ahead and create your outfit, like you guys can go ahead and put on put on any head accessories that you guys want. I believe you guys just cannot change your pants or your shirt. I don't know which one you guys can't change, I don't remember. But yeah, so you guys you guys can change your gloves, you guys can change your shoes, and you guys can also do the glitch again. So if you guys wanna put the paramedic belt on any outfit, just do the same thing we did before. Just right before you guys start up a crook cop, make sure you guys are wearing the outfit that you guys have the paramedic belt on. And then you guys can go ahead and start up a crooked cop and then just scroll left or right on whichever outfit you guys want the paramedic belt on. But yeah, that's basically it. So I hope you guys did enjoy this glitch. Please like and subscribe. Thank you guys for watching. Peace.